What's going on guys? So the other day, the iPhone dev team released yet another brand new jailbreak. This jailbreak is basically just an update to Green Poison, but it is called Absinthe. And this jailbreak finally supports the iPad 2 and the iPhone 4S. We've all been waiting for this for quite a long time and we've been promised it. And uh, it has finally come out. And this jailbreak is going to support the iPad 2 running 5.0.1 firmware only. So you do have to update your iPad 2 to 5.0.1. And it also supports the iPhone 4S on 5.0 and 5.0.1. So either firmware works with the iPhone 4S. Um, Absinthe is only supported for the iPhone 4S and iPad 2. If you have another device that you want to jailbreak, there are a couple of other options and I'll have some links down in the video description down in the underbar um, for those of you who have other devices and want a jailbreak. Uh, so again, this jailbreak called Absinthe only supports iPhone 4S and iPad 2. And again, iPad 2 on 5.0.1 only and iPhone 4S on 5.0 and 5.0.1. Jailbreak is really simple. It's a one-click jailbreak. All you have to do is download Absinthe and it looks like this. Once you download it, open it up and you should get a program that looks like that. I'll have the download links down in the underbar. It is a Windows and it is a Mac jailbreak, so everyone uh, is supported here. And again, just download it, open it up, you'll get a screen that looks like that, and uh, plug in your iPhone 4S or iPad 2 to your computer via USB. Make sure it's plugged in, quit iTunes, open up the Jailbreak 2 tool, and all you have to do is click the Jailbreak button. And that's all you have to do. And uh, what it's gonna do is it's gonna um, restart your device a couple times, it's gonna jailbreak, and it's going to install the Absinthe application onto your device so that you can install Cydia. The restore in progress uh, screen comes up, just leave it alone, don't touch anything, don't do anything with it, uh, it's doing its thing. And uh, we'll go ahead and just run through this process here again. Don't do anything, it's gonna you know restart and, and do a whole bunch of weird things, but uh, again, don't touch it and uh, let it do its thing, and I'll go ahead and let it run through here. All right, and if it boots back up here and goes to the slide to unlock screen, again, don't touch it for a minute. Uh, the progress bar is still going on the jailbreak tool on your computer. Just go ahead and leave it alone for a minute and uh, keep letting it uh, do its thing here, and it should be done in just a minute. All right, and you'll know it's done when the jailbreak tool over here says almost done, just unlock the screen if necessary. Um, so once that screen pops up and the progress bar is all the way full, all you have to do is slide to unlock. And uh, you're going to want to slide over to your last page of apps and you should see the Absinthe icon right here. Go ahead and open it up. Make sure you do have a Wi-Fi or 3G connection. And uh, what it's going to do is it's just going to go ahead and install Cydia right onto your device now. Again, don't touch it. Let it do its thing. And uh, just give it a second to install Cydia here and I'll go ahead and wait for it. All right, and once it's done respringing, go ahead and slide to unlock one last time. Go over to your last page of apps, and you should see the Cydia icon um, now on your device. Your device is all done. It's jailbroken. Um, if you have any blank apps here, go ahead and just restart your device one last time, and all of your apps uh, will come back normal. I'll go ahead and I'll just show you that this is, in fact, running 5.0.1. Um, just so you guys can be sure. There you go, version 5.0.1. And I'll go ahead and open Cydia 2 just so you guys can see. So there you go. Cydia is going to prepare the file system, restart, and it will go back and uh, Cydia will be 100% running on your device. So there you go. If you have any questions, feel free to post a comment down below or send me a message and let me know. Also post down below for those of you guys who have done this jailbreak and uh, let us know that it worked. Again, if you have any questions, let me know and I'll see you guys in the next video.